Tonight is Mexican night, and I'm making a chicken burrito dinner. I'm Tess, and welcome to my kitchen. In my cast iron pan on medium-high heat, I'm adding a couple tablespoons of oil and about two pounds of bite-sized chicken thighs. Adding some salt and black pepper and cooking the chicken until it's no longer pink, and that takes about three minutes. Next, I'm adding one cup of diced red onion, one cup of diced bell pepper, and I just happen to have a yellow pepper, and one seeded finely diced jalapeno, and this is optional. We just like the extra heat. Giving that a good stir and cooking for another two to three minutes. Here I have one small can of chopped green chilies with the juice, and one small can of rinsed and drained black beans. Giving that a good toss and letting it cook for another couple minutes, or until some of the liquid has cooked off. You can find this recipe in the description box below. Please come and visit me on Facebook, Google+, and Test Cooks for You blog. And now for the seasonings. I have two cloves of minced garlic and one minced chipotle pepper. I love the smokiness of the chipotle pepper, and sometimes I add smoked paprika if I don't have the peppers. Adding a quarter cup of chopped fresh parsley, and you can also add cilantro if you wish. A half a teaspoon of cumin, and one teaspoon each of chili powder and oregano. Cooking and stirring for two minutes until the chicken absorbs all the seasonings and everything is well combined. It's done and removed from the heat. And now the fun part, making the burritos. I'm lightly heating my flour tortillas on each side in my pan. I have some grated cheese that is a mixture of cheddar, asiago, and some provolone, just what I happen to have on hand. And next is some healthy scoops of the chicken mixture, giving that a roll, a fold, and another roll, and a hug. And don't forget the hug. That is important. The hug holds the burrito together and makes it taste better. For the sides tonight, I'm making some rice and warming some refried beans. Also have some sliced avocado and a slice of lime on the side. Topping the burrito with some salsa mixed with some larger chopped tomatoes from my garden. A little chopped green onion and can't forget the sour cream. And that's our chicken burrito dinner. It was delicious. What's your favorite burrito? Let me know in the comment section below. And until next time, enjoy. Thanks for joining me here at Test Cooks for You. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe for future recipes and videos. I appreciate all my viewers, and until next time, much love.